covered and in those three scans the common points between uh, these three scans should be at least three and after that you can merge those three scans to get the complete 3d model of the that building of course the top uh, top uh, roof of that building will not be covered because this is a terrestrial lidar scanner and for to cover the roof of that building uh, that uav type of lidar system is required so there are techniques to uh, merge the register the multi platform lidar is, uh, scans also to uh, get the complete building model but here we have only terrestrial lidar scanner so we will uh, do the registration of those uh, terrestrial scans only so sumit are you uh, have you installed the scene software at your pc Yes, sir. I had a stall, but sir, it is, uh, when I am starting, it is saying some error issues. Can you see, sir? Uh, should I share the screen? Yes, you can share the screen. And have you uh, pasted the pasted the patch to the installation directory? Yes, I did. Yes, sir. I had pasted. For that only, I had to uninstall the my antivirus software. That is why uh, then also, sir, it is not getting started. So I am sharing my screen. Okay, okay. share your screen. Sir, is it visible? Yes, yes, visible. Sir, this is the message. Okay, no problem. You can uh, uh, access the laboratory system remotely and can perform the experiment. Okay, so I am locating the scan. Okay. Let me share the screen. So, scans is present in the scans folder uh, within uh, on the desktop, and you can use those scans. These two scans you can use for the registration, and this is the scene software in the. Uh, this uh, lower tab this is called okay scene scene software is installed in this pc you can use and i am sharing the teams id to you So you can please note down this ID and this password. So first the Sumit will come and perform the experiment. So Sumit, please note this uh, ID. Uh, okay, five sir. Five times five times one two one four three four and this password. Sir, uh, are you showing it on the screen? So that is not visible on the screen, sir. This remotely this PC, okay. Sir, enter this uh, ID and password. ID, sir. Yes. Enter this ID and uh, try to connect. Then it will ask for password. Q9G. Can you repeat the ID, sir? I have shared the screen. I hope you can uh, see the ID. Yes, sir. Now it is coming. ID is four times one, two, one, four, three, four.
sir just 2 minutes i am installing the team viewer so I, then i will join you हेलो सर यस सर जिनके पीसी में इंस्टॉल है उनको भी ये टीम व्यूअर को इंस्टॉल करना पड़ेगा नहीं नहीं नो नीड यू कैन जस्ट शेयर योर स्क्रीन एंड एंड आई होप यू हैव डाउनलोडेड द स्कैन्स आल्सो स्कैन data for the experiment one shared in the file section of the teams okay sir yeah. okay please download the data also after that you can perform the experiment at your desktop Sir, I have installed the team viewer. Now, what I have to do, sir? Uh, uh, just uh, I uh, I am asking Sumit first to perform this experiment. After that, uh, it will be your turn to perform this. Okay, sir. Uh, I am Sumit. I am asking team viewer. The one option is coming for I. No password. I am. I am. adding the id recent mode sub saying uh, either your partner is not internet or your partner is running yet just uh, install the default version of this uh, uh, team viewer after that i will provide you the id and password okay so means uh, i don't have to sign in no need to sign in sir uh, sir i am seeing my screen please just check this uh, is it uh, it will be working okay. or not okay You have entered four times one. Just enter five times one. Now connect. Now enter the password. The password is Q nine G Q K P K S. Okay. I hope you are able to see this scans folder now. Okay. Yes. And this is the scene software in the uh, this task bar. Okay, click on that task bar and this is software. <coughs> Then now what?
सर व्हाट टू डू नेक्स्ट सर हेलो सुमित यस यस सर हां नाउ यू नीड टू अपलोड दोस टू स्कैन्स uh and just you need to create first uh, uh, create one project for you okay sir uh, do i have to uh, and put in my computer also sorry sir do i have to download that scan folder in my laptop also no you are performing experiment on this uh, uh, this remote desktop so no need to download that okay sir write the name of project as your name okay yes sir now now go to the import on the top of this screen you can see the import button now you need to drag and drop those two scans in the scans folder copy uh, those two scans first two scans drag the drag, drag those scans no no it will not work like copy and paste you can drag and drop no not in the teams you just go to the scene yeah drop here yeah. so now it is showing that scans are imported and you can see in the left pane there's two scans are visible okay right click on those scans and process this scan click on process scan so it will take some time so uh, wait for that okay sir now you can see here uh, the different options are uh, coming for the configuration of this uh, scans so see here click on the find checkerboards and find spheres because we have placed the checkerboards and spheres on the field and here you can see the sphere radii is uh, 6.8 uh, 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 cm okay and after that you can click on start processing button sir so they were uh, tell you i need uh, point 069 and uh, point 0.69 uh, it is uh, detecting the spheres uh, within this range okay so okay. the sphere we have placed 
the radii of those spheres is this 6.95 cm okay okay sir now what sir uh, you can click on the start processing button so you are processing the scan one so uh, in processing step it is basically the pre processing step in this uh, it is removing the outliers from the data okay sir it is only for this this time it is taking that your voice is break, breaking sumit uh, please uh, say again sir i am asking that uh, this is only taken by this software or you just write in the meeting chat Uh, sumit uh, it will take uh, time depending upon the size of your uh, point cloud data so the data size is big so that's why it is taking this much of time okay sir so you can see the size of data here so data size is 1.21 gb okay that's why it is taking this much of time and it is it also depends upon system capability okay so 
it is saying uh, saying that uh, the scan one is fully processed now after that you need to uh, process the scan two and you can click on uh, scan two and process this and select the spheres and checkerboards it will find checkerboards and spheres from the data and just click on start processing So uh, this uh, second scan also processed, and after that you can visualize uh, those two scans. Okay, so click on scan one and click on view. Then click for quick view. and click on planar view also right click on those scan and click on planar view oh. Oh. yes shubham screen to share to you. That is great. Okay, okay. Let me share this.
so you can see this uh, multiple checkerboards and uh, spheres are detected okay but some of the checkerboards are falsely detected and spheres are also false detected so you need to remove you can see that uh, checkerboard is detected on the tree i have not placed the checkerboard on the tree okay and this is sphere also detected on the tree but i have not placed so you need to remove those uh, checkerboards and uh, spheres so for that purpose you can go to the particular scan and click on in the left pane you can see the checkerboard container and sphere container okay in the checkerboard container you can go to the specific checkerboard suppose this is the checkerboard one and right click on that and you can locate that checkerboard and this checkerboard is located and you can see the checkerboard is placed here also so this is uh, this checkerboard is correctly detected so you need not to remove this checkerboard and again you can go to the checkerboard 2 and this checkerboard is also present okay now go to the checkerboard 3 you can see the checkerboard is not present here so you can delete this checkerboard okay click on yes okay so sumit so you can do uh, you can locate the checkerboard 5 6 7 8 and check whether these are present or not if they are not present you can delete those uh, checkerboards so 6 is not present here okay so just delete that uh, checkerboard hello sir yes the uh, when it sort software i will sort the temp and get track of so but every time it is doing the application was not correctly so uh, show me your voice is breaking uh, you you can type in the meeting chat on sir uh, uh, application error is so it is not start Where? hello sorry shubham i am uh, not uh, your voice is not clear to me sir i am telling that the application error going in my desktop and laptop okay i will resolve that issue uh, okay after this lab okay it should not happen you just install that uh, uh, that software and just paste the crack in the installation directory and replace that file i have done that process sir place the file place okay the file. there may be some other issue uh, i will resolve that okay don't worry so this is fear is present sir is it present yes it is present this is not present okay and now do the same process to the scan 2 first visualize the scan You want planar view, na? No? Mm -hmm. 
So locate each checkerboard and see uh, whether they are present or not. This is not present. This is false sphere, you can delete this. While doing survey, I have prepared a manual map of this area where uh, with, uh, on which location the spheres and checkerboards are present. Uh, based on uh, that map, I also uh, predicted whether a sphere, this is the detective sphere or some false sphere. This is a false sphere. Okay. No, no. This is false. This is not false. This is present. Okay. Some type of hindrance is coming for this sphere. Sir, is it there? Yes, yes. This is sphere is present. You can minimize and you can give, uh, see the better visualization. It has uh, sphere and sphere bottom also present. Okay. After that, you can go to the next step. registration so first you can perform the automatic registration and if you are not satisfied with the accuracy of this automatic registration then you can perform the manual registration process so it is selected uh, that top view and cloud cloud based method is used Okay, first you should try the target based and click on register and verify. So now you can see
you can see the locations of those two scans from which the tripod was placed and scanner was placed at location one and two okay to cover those uh, this all field so and the scans are must correctly okay so you can see the report here you are getting this kind of this much of accuracy okay if your uh, for particular application this accuracy is sufficient then you can proceed with this uh, registration or you can update the met method of registration to get a better accuracy so uh, sumit now try the manual registration just cancel this and click on this uh, start manual registration so in the manual registration process you need to select the one image from selection 1 and another image from selection 2 and you need to mark the common targets so i have selected this from uh, this one okay you are saying that uh, image is not present Sir. here so uh, sir uh, this uh, should i select this one the image is also present in this uh, if you rotate the um, rotate the scan it you will get here also and you can select from both of the scans okay no problem first from the scan 1 and another from scan 2 this is scan uh, 22 is your first and 23 is second so first image should be uh, scan 1 and another should be scan 2 okay sir i am getting little bit confused sir yes please ask sir means what should i do next now what should i say select first image from uh, scan 1 okay and second from this and then you can click on mark targets so let me demonstrate so you can see this is sphere is present above the gate okay and we need to find that sphere in another scan also so i have seen that this sphere is the same as the this sphere in the scan 1 when i am saying scan 1 means this left side first image and right side image is the second scan so the sphere 5 is common in both the scans so you can mark the sphere click on mark sphere in the left pane and click at the center of this sphere so as i said i i need to mark at least three markers to register the scans so we can take two spheres one checkerboard three spheres or three checkerboards or two checkerboards one sphere okay at least three should be common and mark the sphere at the in the second scan also after that you can rotate the scan and search for the another common object so
you can see that we have find the common checkerboard and sphere here so first mark the sphere sphere in the scan one and sphere in the scan two and it is marked now now you can mark the checkerboard so here in the left pane you can see the option of uh, mark checkerboard and click at the center of this checkerboard and here also and we have marked uh, three uh, targets and now we can do the registration so click on register and verify so now you can see those two scans are registered now and you can also see the boundary of this uh, park biotechnologically uh, biotechnological experiment park uh, sorry uh, biotechnology experimental field this boundary uh, you can clearly see so Sir. yes the please uh, can you show this Sumit, you you want to perform at yourself? No, yes. I am asking you to perform. But you want to perform? Uh, you want to see the process of manual registration again? Yes, sir. Okay. After that, this option will come. this is the manual registration so it need uh, to optimize the uh, scan okay so after that you can optimize those two scans and you can see the report so here you can see a little bit uh, more accurate uh, more accurate results are obtained okay so if you want to perform the manual registration you can click on right uh, right pane here you can see the start manual registration option okay click on that and select uh first image from the selection one and second from the you can see this this is a 22 scan is the first scan and this 23 is the second scan so we are trying to find the common targets between those two scans after that you can click on mark targets scan is one is loading now okay it will take some time to load after that you can see this is sphere and uh, and this is sphere is common in both the scans okay we can also mark the checkerboard but uh, the checkerboard is not visible in the scan 1 okay so it is not possible to mark here so sphere is visible so we can mark the sphere so click on sir mark sphere yes sir uh, on the basis of the play it is okay on that way uh, we are it from uh your voice is not clear to me please say it again i am writing sir okay
Sumit, because we have performed the experiment on the field, so I know better where uh, the common targets can be obtained. So I know where I have placed the checkerboards and where I have placed the spheres. So I I have uh, better knowledge of the field. So if you plan a survey, then you 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 will prepare a manual map of that, and based on that map, you can locate the spheres and checkerboards. So because you have not performed the experiment on the field, that's why uh, you you are uh, finding it difficult to find the common spheres and checkerboards. And I have uh, the complete knowledge of that survey area, so uh, I am able to uh, identify the common spheres and checkerboards. So now you can mark the sphere. So, so the center of sphere will be taken. There is it marked. It will uh, take some time, okay? Because I have already marked, then you again mark, so it is uh, somewhat creating problem. So let me do first, then I will give you time to do this manual registration, okay? Okay. Sir. So I have marked the sphere, sphere seven here. Now you can see the sphere seven and five are common. You need to mark the sphere in the both the scans. After that, you can locate the another common point. As you can see, uh, this. Now you can mark the checkerboard. On the same pillar, you can find the checkerboard, but the orientation is different. This, this checkerboard five and checkerboard five in the another scan are common. After that, you can mark the sphere. This sphere and uh, sphere eight and with the same name sphere 8 is common in an, in scan 2 after that you can register and verify because we have marked the at least three targets then it will ask are you satisfied with the result you can visually see whether the boundary of this spark is uh, combined perfectly or joined perfectly or not based on that you can decide whether uh, the result is good or not after that you can further optimize the results so you can choose any one of this uh, optimization algorithm to perform the optimization of this registration process then you can click on optimization then it will further optimize the results and you can see the report here so now the registration is complete so now sumit you need to perform this manual registration at your end okay sir
because first you have selected the second scan okay so you cannot get the same scan in both the images so in the another section the second scan must be there so is it okay now now okay and first you were trying to mark the scan 23 first and then you can mark the 22 scan no issue in that okay you can reverse the also what sir do i have to go back no need no need now you can rotate and see where the targets are present based on the surrounding objects you can decide whether this sphere is the same one or not so you can rotate the scan also and see the surrounding objects and decide uh, the matching object sir how to rotate this sir? Just left, 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 left,
और आई थिंक वो था कि Yes, you have selected the correct spheres and checkerboards, and those spheres and checkerboards are common. You can mark those. and no 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 you just need one more target at least three targets should be there let me find for you okay this is sphere is here and you can see the sphere one here so this is the common sphere this sphere is behind the box and you can see the box here also okay and based on the surrounding objects you can decide with the common sphere is present or not now you can click on register and verify so you can zoom in the scans and see whether these are uh, boundary lines are perfectly matching or not Sir, how to check this that uh, boundary lines are matching or not? See the scan position one and two are uh, visible to you. Means its scans are merged, and if the boundary of those two scans are not matching, some alignment is uh, can some kind of misalignment is there. Then you can decide whether this. Uh, uh this these two scans are merged or not okay after that you can click on finish and further you can optimize those scans so click on cloud to cloud
so we are getting 43.1 percent overlapping here okay and you can see the point error and mean point error so i hope now you can perform this experiment at your end also okay i am calling the next uh, candidate here Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. Alok Kumar. Sir, should I stop from my side? Yes, yes, you can. Yes, sir. Alok, uh, have you installed the scene at your end? Yes, sir. And data? Yes, sir. Okay, now you can share your screen and. Sir, and I have shared, already shared my screen. Okay, okay, good. Now do the manual registration. I hope the uh, uh, automatic registration uh, can uh, perform, everyone can perform the automatic registration. You just need to perform the manual registration. Sir, directly? Uh, I was. I, 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 I hope you have uh, loaded the data and processed also. Sir, I am doing processing, sir, right now. Okay, do the processing and uh, start from uh, from the steps you have uh, not performed. Okay, remove the. Falsely detected spheres and checkerboards. This is the false one, okay? Because uh, I have not placed this sphere there. Now go to the scan two and remove the unnecessary uh, means falsely detected uh, spheres and checkerboards. This is correct one. Some uh, hindrance is there, but this is correct one. Well, now I have to perform registration directly now. Have you processed the scan or not? Sir, process the scan. One minute. Yes, sir. Yeah, okay. Now, now you can go to the registration.
you want to perform uh, automatic registration okay sir uh, now manual registration yes yes So select uh, yes. select first one image from selection one and another from se uh, selection two because there are two scans and you mm -hmm. need to find the common targets. Okay, sir. So both the scans are loading. Please wait for some time. Should I have cancelled? No, uh, I hope uh, you another image is not visible, so two images should be there. So, so I cancel, cancel this one. Cancel this and start again. Now you just need to mark the common points. You need to find at least three common targets, whether it it, it is a sphere or checkerboard.
I think this one is right. Yes, yes, correct. So only I have to mark in one image. No, both the images, and you can zoom in more to get better accuracy. You you need to uh, mark perfectly at the center of the sphere. No, so checkerboard is not present here. Okay. So no. you need to find the common checkerboard. Sir, how to uh, you can rotate, rotate the scan? You can rotate the scan. Sir, this is fair is common. No? no, no. It is placed um, in the middle of the field and that is placed on the boundary. Okay, sir. Yeah, this uh, left side, those those spheres are common. You can go near the greenhouse and you can find the common targets there. But in second image, I am not able to find this. Yes, yes, stop here. Okay. Drag, drag to the find this structure, this uh, greenhouse, and zoom in. You can find. Yeah, yeah. Now stop and zoom in this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, those two spheres and checkerboards. Because this scan is taken from another position and first scan is from another position. So you will you can see the difference in the orientation, but those are the common spheres and checkerboards. So three uh, target has been marked. Mark the spheres also. Okay, now you can uh, register and verify. Click on register and verify. Uh, are you satisfied with the result? Click on yes. Just visualize with the boundaries are matched or not. Now, minimize those scans. Sir, I have to perform optimization also. Yes, yes. Hmm. Now you can see the report in using this option uh, from yes. See the registration report. Mm -hmm. so nice. yes. Now hello, you can leave. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir.
Now I am calling Arun Kumar Sahani. Yes, sir. Yes, uh, now you can perform the experiment. Sorry, sir, my system is wrong, sir. Okay. Okay. So I hope you have understood the process and you can perform this later on. OK. Yes, sir. Now, Ruchi Devedi. Yes, sir. <clears throat> sir Could you um, perform sir, this experiment? Sir, in, no, sir. Actually, sir, internet is still very slow at my end, sir. I can't in, in, unstall, install the sir, uh, teaching software. Okay, uh, but uh, you have Teams VS at your end. No, sir. Do you have? The internet speed is very slow at my end at that time, sir. Okay, I hope you have understood the process. Okay, and yes. I will ask you to perform the experiment anytime again. Okay. Okay, sir. Now, Shubham Kumar. Yes, sir. Sunil Kumar, Shubham. Yes, sir. Yes, could you perform this experiment? The screen software is not working, sir. So some error, different error. Okay. Okay. Can you perform uh, the remotely, remotely using this uh, uh, team viewer? Right now, I don't. Have you don't have team viewer, right? Yes. I have installed okay. this uh, team software. It was working when I installed it. It opened, but now it is not opening. The error is showing that uh, the code execution cannot process. No, for the team viewer. If you have team viewer, you can perform the experiment in the uh, uh, PC in the laboratory. Okay. So I am sharing uh, ID and password. You can perform. OK. OK, Shubham. Yes, sir. So let me share you the ID and password for Teams. So you can use this ID and password. This is the ID. And you can use this password. Yes, sir. sir, I am downloading Team Viewer app. OK, download it. Sunil Kumar. Yes, sir. Do you have seen it in your PC or desktop? Sir, system load processing with data upload or Okay. Do you have team we are right? Yes, sir. Team we were high up PC. Mein? Yes, sir. OK, use this ID and password and access this laboratory system remotely.
uh, now you can open the scene software in the task bar you can see the scene option it is already, uh, it is already open uh, now now you can open it. now create a project in your name now import the data <coughs> क्लिक ऑन इम्पोर्ट जस्ट क्लिक ऑन दैट थिंक यू आर डिस्कनेक्टेड now click on import import click on import not processing import sir import now you have a scans folder in the desktop drag and drop those two scans sir operator folder this folder sorry this one scans drop to the scan software i uh, seen software sorry not teams seen here yeah. ट्राई अगेन let me do for you okay, okay do it do it. no you need to come to the software just drag it and when this green color appears then you can draw now you can process those two scans together so click on scans and process scans so in this way you can process those two scans simultaneously so click on find checkerboards and find spheres after that you can click on start processing click on start processing so need
now directly go to the registration okay because we need go to the registration and you can delete uh, those two is uh, those uh, falsely detected spheres and checkerboard later on also so just perform automatic registration Now you can rotate this scan by left clicking and dragging. And if you scroll, then you can zoom in and zoom out the scans. Thank you. 
इट इज सेल पॉइंट यस यस 2000 स्पीयर एंड चेकर बोर्ड क्लिक ऑन मार्क यस You have marked somewhere else. That's why it is showing somewhere else. You have marked here. Okay. That's why it is showing this error. Click at the center of this field. And. <coughs> Now mark the checker board. I have marked the sphere. Now you need to mark the checker board. Click on yes. Checker board. Now you need to find another target. Okay. that is common so this is sphere and you can see that sphere is not visible okay so you can find another sphere so this sphere is common okay you can see the box here this container here and here also based on that you have decided that this is the common sphere so you can mark now click on register and verify you can see the those two scans are perfectly stitched together so click on yes and you can see the report here okay okay so now you can leave sunil shubham thank you yes sir Yes, you can log in in that viewer. Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. Uh, so, yes. perform the registration. Okay, manual registration again. Just start. Mark target. 
Yes. It is not. Can. You can rotate the scan by left clicking in the mouse and drag. And you can use the scroll button in the mouse to zoom in and zoom out of this scan. So there are two separate windows and two separate scans. On those two scans, you need to find the common target points. How can this common target point be? Based on the surrounding area, you can decide which one is uh, common. So you can see this sphere is present yes. uh, somewhere above the gate, and you need to find the gate in the another scan. So you you can see this is the gate, uh, and left gate you can find this. Uh, common sphere okay and you can see here near the this greenhouse you can see one is sphere and checkerboard and and this is common to this uh, checkerboard and sphere and you can find another one like uh, one sphere is present here behind the box and you can find the box in the scan here this is the box and you can see the sphere so you can easily find at least four common points here and for another you can find this sphere and this sphere is also present here this sphere seven is also common okay so you need to mark at least three sphere three uh, targets so mark the common target points I'm zooming. So this is the first one, okay? And, and this same sphere is present in the another scan. So First, mark these two spheres using mark sphere in the left pane. Now, just click on this. Now, click at the center of this sphere. Click on mark sphere and then click at the center of this sphere. Now you need to mark at another sphere. You mark in the first scan and then you need to mark in the second scan also. After that I have to click mark. No, you need to click again and again. Then mark here. So sphere is marked 
now you can find another common points so you can see here one checkerboard and one sphere is common so mark checkerboard here and then mark the sphere in the both the scans i am marked and now now you can click on register and verify now you can visualize the scan and see whether uh, the point clouds are merged or not after that you need to optimize these scans when we are doing the in my way everything is looking quite simple yes everything is looking right but uh, if you go at, uh, at the millimeter level accuracy then you need optimization now you can see uh, this uh, this uh, main point error you are getting here so uh, less than 1 cm error is uh, obtained in the registration you can further reduce by uh, marking more targets in the scans okay you can further reduce the errors now i am calling jashri Sunil, you can leave. Subham. Yes. Okay. Jashri. Sir, good morning, sir. Good morning. Uh, do you have team viewer in your desktop? No, sir. And do you have scene installed in your PC? Sir, I tried it uh, installing. Sir, uh, actually after your suggestions, also I uh, made the antivirus off, but it is unable to uh, download in my system. So something is uh, displaying as troubling in the background. Some troubleshoot tab is appearing. Okay, okay, no problem. But you you can connect with the teams team viewer. No issue. Okay, sir. So I am sharing uh, ID and password. Have you installed Team Viewer in your PC? No, sir. Okay. So, in the next meeting, uh, I will ask you to first perform the experiment, and then I will proceed with the second experiment. Okay. So, by the next week, you okay, must sir. be ready with the your uh, Team Viewer or your scene software installed in your PC. and the remaining students will perform this uh, first experiment then we will proceed to the second experiment okay, okay thank sir. you for all uh, uh, thank, thank you, you all for today and you can leave the now leave meeting now